Lawmakers in Korea today passed a Rivers Act revision, responding to the recent catastrophic flooding and landslides following unusually heavy monsoon rains. This will allow money from state coffers to be used for flood prevention measures. Kim Jong-shi reports. I declare that the amendment has been passed. A revision to the Rivers Act intended to support the implementation of anti-flooding measures was passed by the National Assembly with 249 votes in favor out of the 250 lawmakers present. The bill was passed in a plenary session with an overwhelming approval rate regardless of political party. The swift decision came about two weeks after catastrophic flooding and landslides in central South Korea took nearly 50 lives and ruined people's homes and livelihoods. At least 14 people died when a river burst its banks due to heavy rain and flooded an underpass in Osong in a matter of minutes. Until now, local governments were responsible for these regional rivers and they experienced budgetary problems for maintenance and repair. The amendment allows the state to provide financial support for the maintenance of designated regional rivers currently conducted by local governments whose water levels may change due to potential flooding downstream by rivers maintained by the state. The assembly also passed revisions to water system management and support for residents near the Kumgang, Nakdonggang, Yongsangang, and Samjinggang rivers. With the revision setting the legal framework for water-related disasters such as droughts and floods, these residents can use the water system management budget for disaster prevention measures. The revised laws will be enacted as soon as the government publishes it. The legislation for the Anti-Flooding Act in urban areas, on the other hand, was not discussed at Thursday's plenary session. The main part of the act is to establish a national countermeasures committee under the environment minister and to systematically promote urban flood prevention plans with other related ministries. The National Assembly Legislation and Judiciary Committee said since it's a legislative action, more discussion is needed, but it also added that the goal is to process the legislation at next month's plenary session. Kim Jong-sil, Arirang News.